The boot of Europe is in the international spotlight, and not just for the search for a new pope. Former Italian Prime Minister Silvio Berlusconi has a secret weapon for becoming PM again, promising tax refunds to voters. Thousands of voters received letters from Berlusconi this week promising to refund their taxes. The letters came in envelopes designed to resemble official documents from the Italian Treasury. As Italian newspapers show, the white envelope with the message, Important Notice, Reimbursement of IMU 2012, written in blue, isn't exactly what it seems. Citizens first open the letters thinking the Treasury will give them their money back and instead find the logo of Berlusconi's People of Freedom Party. The BBC reports the letters have arrived to citizens of key swing regions like Sicily and Lombardy. The tax Berlusconi promises to abolish is the most criticized budget measure of Prime Minister Mario Monti's government of technocrats. Monti has led Italy since Berlusconi quit 15 months ago amid the financial crisis. Berlusconi, the richest man in Italy, has been criticized for the strategies he uses to gain votes. Last month, for instance, Berlusconi made headlines for praising fascist dictator Benito Mussolini during a Holocaust memorial. The racial laws were the worst fault of Mussolini as a leader, who in so many other ways did well, he said. So what chance does the scandal-prone Berlusconi have in Sunday's election? As of the most recent polls, a pretty good one, actually. In just over a month, Berlusconi cut the center-left party's 10-point lead in half. The Wall Street Journal says that has more to do with Berlusconi's opponents than his own appeal. Europe and the world are wondering what is wrong with Italy. How is it possible that Silvio Berlusconi might win the upcoming elections? The more relevant question is why a reasonable alternative does not emerge. For Newsy, I'm Zach Toombs. Multiple sources, a broader view.